Okay, so I just finished listening to Future. Uh, we don't, we still don't trust you, Future and Metro Boomin, and I'm not impressed. Performance level was low. Okay, uh, they started out hard with the "We Don't Trust You" with the weekend. That was nice. I'm like, okay, nice little good intro, get us in the mood, and then we stayed in that same mood. We stayed in that same mood. This is wine music. I don't know why Future and Metro Boomin want to make wine music. I'm thinking they're gonna come out hard. Second time, we might get some more disses, right? I'm like, put the kids to bed. Then I'm like, wake the kids up because it's PG over here. It was ridiculous. And then I just was sitting back like, what is going on? What is going on? How many future speakeasy songs am I going to listen to? He, he's just singing the whole time, just uh, uh, melodic the whole time. I don't know if he's trying to get Lori Harvey back, but this is Lover Boy Future. Okay, like the first part, we don't trust you was for the fellas. This is for the women. It's like, we still don't trust you because they, they're talking about women now. Okay, we don't trust you. With, we don't trust men. We still don't trust you. We don't trust women. They just don't trust people, I guess. Uh, J. Cole sounded dry, uh, drowsy. Sound like he was on NyQuil. I don't know if they perked him up before that, but uh, they even made J. Cole sound sleepy. So uh, I'm ready for bed. That, that's one thing I can say. I'm ready for bed. After listening to half the album, The Weekend 8, though, uh, the Isley Brothers sample, I was getting mad because I was like, y'all are wasting the Isley Brothers sample. And then The Weekend came in and flushed the whole song out. But the first half of the song uh, was not great. Um, and he obviously ate up the intro. We we still don't trust you. Um, so, yeah, disappointment, man. Disappointment. I was just waiting for them to compose more raps, but they didn't. They just composed a bunch of... R&B, Mozart, seductive music. So it's just like, all right, I guess you're Chris Brown now. It was just a bunch of R&B music. They, they said they don't like Drake, but you acting like him. Okay, you just making rap R&B. All right, there's R&B singers out here already. We don't need this from you. Thug R&B, what do you... Come on, man. You're supposed to make music for, for criminals. <laughs> making thug R&B. Nobody wants to hear this.